Rustic 80 is a traditional sliding door hardware system with beautifully crafted barn-style hangers for doors weighing up to 80 kilograms. It's ideal for barn conversions, period properties, or simply for a unique feature in the home. The system is available in a matte black powder coat or stainless steel finish in a choice of two track lengths. A fittings kit can also be purchased for where an additional door is required. Prior to installation, the door will require some routing to fit the flush pulls and to create the guide channel in the bottom of the door. The kit. Flat track and fittings. Hangers and bolts. Track wall spacers. Floor guide. Anti-jump cams. Door stops. Oval flush pulls. The tools. Spanners. Drill. Drill bits tape measure, pencil, screwdriver, spirit level, tri-square. Fitting the hangers. To attach the hangers to the door, we first need to measure 100 millimeters in from the vertical edge of the door and mark with a pencil. Use the tri-square to draw a vertical line through the 100 millimeter marking. Over your guideline, measure 42 millimeters from the top of the door and mark with a pencil. Then measure an additional 90 millimeters and mark with a pencil. Lay the hanger over the markings to check the holes are correctly spaced. Create pilot holes if necessary before drilling the 10 millimeter holes through the door. Unscrew the accompanying hanger bolts. And manually fasten the hanger to the door, making sure that the bolt fastening is on the front of the door. Use the spanners to tighten and fix. Repeat this step for both hangers. Fitting the flush pulls. Separate out the two parts of the flush pull. Place the bottom half into the pre-routed area using a screwdriver to screw in place. Push the top half of the flush pull into place until you hear a click. Repeat this for the second flush pull on the reverse side of the door. Installing the track to the wall. The centre of the track should be placed at a measurement of the door height plus 40 centimetres. Measure this distance from the floor and mark with a pencil on both sides of the opening. Using the track and spirit level, draw a straight line through both markings. Using the tri-square, draw a line directly up from the corner of the opening to meet your track line. Make sure to do this on the side of the opening which your door will close to. From this line, measure the distance stated in the fitting instructions for the position of the first track fixing hole. Place the track so that the first hole is lined up with the marking you just made and mark the rest of the fixing holes with a pencil before drilling the pilot holes. Manually fix the track bolt and spacers to the track before placing into the first pilot hole. Tighten with a spanner. Repeat this step for the rest of the track fixings. Hanging the door. Lift the door and hang onto the track, testing that it runs smoothly across the track. Place track stops into position and slide the door to test you're happy with the positioning. Tighten with an Allen key. Do this on both sides. Once the stops are secured into position, fit the anti-jump cams with a screwdriver.
fixing the floor guide. Use a spirit level to check the door is straight and hold in position. Position the guide centrally under the door and mark out the pilot hold positions. Drill pilot holes before screwing the guide securely into position. A fittings kit is available in order to create a double door application. Visit our website for details.